change the benchmarks. Hey, y'all go get a deal and bring it back. I'll take less. I'll take less. Not much less. Not much less. But I'll take less if y'all source it. Hey, y'all go get the advertiser and the integration. Hey, we talk about these deals all the time. You bring it, you eat different. I bring it, I eat different. You niggas ain't brought shit and got the nerve to have y'all fucking representation and ain't been around in six years hit Ian phone about something. I won't say what I want to say, but y'all will not continue to treat me this way. Y'all not going to continue to treat these people this way. Y'all take that fucking dark energy, that arrogance, and that entitlement somewhere else. PTSD. I say all of that to say, we're going to do this. Since Rory feels like he has so many options here. Somehow he still feels like he's running the show. He still feels like he has choices and options. He feels like he's entitled to more. Rory, you are in breach of your contract, and from this point forward, you are fired, and you're not welcome back. Does anybody in here have a problem that I'm the person that has to say that? No. Maul, I'm the person that has to say that. The gall of you to think that you are observing the way that I am. Rory can go, Rory and Maul can go start a podcast. Well, no, they can't. Not at least for another year. By contract. If they do, I'm going to sue the fucking pants off of them. But whenever they're able to, they can go and start a podcast. They can pay for the staffing. They can source the advertising. They can source the integrations. They can pay the insurance. Studio time. They could pay for the studio time. Engineer. Set, location, engineer. They could pay for the LLC formation. They right, could sure. pay for the insurance. They could pay what it costs to go on tour. You could pay what it costs for the hours of lawyer lawyer uh, work for deals that don't get done. Mm. You can go do all of those things, but not here some reason was questioning me and friendship and, and my character you was there you was there. I was there he was questioning my friendship and my character as someone that has overpaid him and overprotected him because I speak to academics because I did a live with academics why are you not allowed to communicate with this man? I'm so confused with that whole thing. And that was the same pod that I came in here and said, I was referencing Snowfall. I said, you know, y'all want me to be mad at how another nigga talk? They both sat here and agreed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, nigga. That's what y'all doing. <laughs> Rory thought that I that our friendship was in turmoil and I, and I, and I didn't view him as a friend and he couldn't view me as a friend because... I may work with academics again in the future. We had we had a show that I think was one of the best shows ever made. That's a great show. And we have been getting offers for that show since I left that show. That's on us to do it or not. He don't need it and I don't need it. Nobody needs it. Everybody's rich. Niggas is cute and rich. And they came with fiancés. I wasn't that fortunate. <laughs> Yeah, Swim with the pigs. Man. No, they came with my baby. No, they came with my baby. <laughs> Fiance just had a different ring to it. I still got my ring in the jewelry. You know what I mean? <laughs> so so yeah, 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 yeah. Purpose the ring. <laughs> but I'm saying he was questioning our friendship based off the fact that I may work with academics again in the future. There is a mutual respect between me and that guy. I'm sorry that the rest of the industry may feel differently about it. I've worked with him. I understand him. I get it. But that was a real bad pod the day the day that we recorded that when he was mad. And then Maul came in and Rory said, Rory said, Maul, you know Joe would work with academics again? And Maul said, yeah, man, but you already knew that. I didn't pay that no mind, that little exchange. But boy, was it important. 